A big night as fans get ready for the college football national championship Monday. Republican State Representative Jason Sane says it's time for North Carolina to join about two dozen other states and let people bet on that game from their phones. He pushed for that last year, only to see the bill fail by just one vote in the House. Do you think anything is different this time around? I do. I, for one, you know, it's kind of a new idea when we first brought it last session, and it was something that we knew would really need to marinate. Uh, as people you know, got familiar with the issue. Do you think anybody has changed their minds for sure on this that you've talked to? I do. Sane says he'll file a bill similar to the one from last year. That one would have legalized betting on professional, collegiate, amateur, and electronic sports. Democratic Representative Pricey Harrison voted against it, saying she's still opposed to betting on college games and using credit cards. I think there's a chance we could reach a compromise if we could agree to certain restrictions and protections. She proposed only legalizing betting on professional sports at the venues in Raleigh and Charlotte where professional teams play. The whole point of doing it is making sure that we're not losing those dollars to other states because if you're not allowing college betting, they're just going to go to the other state what they're doing now. And, and place those bets. About a quarter of the General Assembly's members will be new this year, which could impact the outcome. There is a younger class coming in, and a bunch of the old guard uh, that were anti-gambling um, are gone and replaced by younger members. And that, that dynamic might change the vote count a bit.